Denise Van Aden looked incredible as she shot the music video for her brand new disco single to mark Pride Month after splitting with her ex fiance Eddie Box Hall. The presenter, 48, is set to release a cover of the 1970s classic from New York to LA and was busy filming scenes for the sensational music video on Thursday. Glamorous first look photographs showed Denise flaunting her incredible figure in a sparkling green mini dress with a tie belt as she struck a pose in front of a bar. She put her toned pegs on full display in a statement pair of rose gold heels and accessorized her ensemble with a green pendant necklace and silver rings. The actress, who has appeared in West End musicals Legally Blonde and Chicago, accentuated her striking features with a dramatic slick of mascara and a touch of foundation as she flashed a huge grin. Denise styled her platinum blonde tresses in glamorous waves loosely cascading across her shoulders as she looked every inch the disco diva. She was joined by backup dancers and drag queens as they put together an incredible music video for Denise's cover track. Scenes saw Denise singing while standing in front of a dimly lit bar while she struck moves with performers beside her, while others danced on top of the bar. Other moments saw her sitting around a table and enjoying drinks with a huge crowd as they got in the partying atmosphere, while disco lights shone around them. There was also light-up dance floor in the venue as they embodied the 70s feeling with the glittering music video. Denise's version of From New York to L.A. and the accompanying music video are both being released on June 24 to mark Pride Month. Speaking about the venture, Denise explained that she wanted to create an inclusive video as she has been a big supporter of the Lutki Plus community for decades. She said, I've always been a big supporter of Pride Month and am proud to be an LGBTQ plus ally for decades now. I wanted to shoot a video that was inclusive and something that everyone could enjoy and sing along to. The star, who in 1998 released a cover of Kylie Minogue and Jason Donovan's hit Especially For You with Johnny Vaughn and Steps, has worked with producer Steve Anderson on her new record and described it as a feel-good dance track. She added, It was great to collaborate with Steve Anderson on this feel-good dance record. I hope everyone enjoys Pride 2022 and has an amazing time this summer. The track, which was first recorded by Patsy Gallant back in 1977 as a reworked version of French song Mon Pays, will also feature an intro from RuPaul's Drag Race judge Michel Visage. Her single's release comes after she left her partner of seven years Eddie, 49, on January 7, after he was reportedly caught having phone sex with other women. She left her partner of seven years, 49, on January 7, after he was reportedly caught having phone sex with other women. And earlier this week, she admitted her fears over its impact upon her child, 12, who she shares with her ex-husband Lee Mead, who she was married to between 2009 and 2013.
speaking on Fran Cotton's Happy Place podcast, the TV personality said, Kids have phones now, and they're at school where they are going to read things and hear things, so I did have to be completely honest with her. And actually it want to be honest with her. I think it's important with your kids to have that honesty. There are still things I probably haven't told her or I've held back. There have been moments where I've been really upset and you don't want your child to see you upset, because it's a horrible thing. But at the same time, she kind of does need to know as well. I can't just brush everything under the carpet. As a parent, my responsibility is to guide her through life and I worry she's going to think that things go wrong. That she's going to go into relationships when she's older perhaps not with an open heart, and that's what I don't want to happen. That's where it's tricky. Denny split from Eddie in a bitter breakup, after finding messages he sent to other women during the relationship. Following the split, Eddie admitted to sending up to 20 sex messages behind Denise's back to other women, following her discovery of the messages on his iPad. The star confronted Eddie over the messages in November, before kicking him out of her home he shared, 